Welcome back to the channel, everybody. We are on the back nine of McNaughton. If you haven't caught the front nine yet, click the card up top, takes you to the video. Watch that first, then come back. We are two down. We're looking to get about six down. Don't know if it'll happen, but let's find out. All right, hole 10, throwing my Avenger SS. Going straight up and to the right. It turns flat once you go up the hill, so it's a pretty easy three on a par four. Yeah, that one's up there. Um, that's actually a pretty good shot. It's gonna be just on the flat side. Let's go take a look. Oh, get in there. Oh my gosh. I slid down the hill on this huge mud. Look at this. <laughs> I slid in this mud and then almost went in the basket. That's crazy. Let's go get this three. Easy three, easy three. Hole 11, par three, all the way down the pipe here. I think it's like 360, I think. Don't quote me. Throw in my thrasher, try to get it all the way down. I'm not too good at these straight shots yet, so I usually get like a four or five on this one, so bear with me. That was a pretty good shot, actually. I'm, I surprised myself. It skipped into the left down there, so I really hope I'm not too far in the woods. I'm just over here in the woods. I'm just gonna throw out baskets right there. How are the how are thorns still alive? What the heck? Oh, just sit. Okay. Man, I thought that was gonna skip and fly away. <laughs> I usually don't film tap-ins, but I'm really happy I got a three on this. Like, really happy. Okay, so this one, the tee pad is back way past the woods here. And you have to come all the way out over top and go right into this tunnel here. And the basket's all the way down there. You can't even see it yet. But it's, it's still par three. I usually land out here to try to pitch down. So let's just see what we can do. All right, hole 11, you just saw it. I'm just gonna try and forehand a force down there just to get to the lip. have myself some uh, tree problems. I'm gonna have to throw a thumber with my heat. Not very good at thumbers yet. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. That was close. I, I hit a branch and it just knocked me down. Otherwise, that was perfect. I just almost threw that in. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't even have it on camera either. I'm really upset with myself. All right, that was a bogey. I am now back to two under. So I'm still okay. There's some par fours back here that I can get. Hole 13, par three, 418 feet, throwing my Hades. Just basically gonna see how far I can rip it.
Well, I can always say I was just laying up in the first place. <laughs> the back nine is definitely harder than the front nine. There, I am getting to the par fours back here, but even those to me are, they're pretty hard to birdie. Uh, I'm playing a tournament later on this year for like the NADGT amateur, actually put on by my friend Dalton. And um, I'm trying to get six down by, I'm trying to average like six down by the time that tournament comes around, but it's gonna be hard. All right, hole 14. I think it's like 500 something feet. I don't know the exact feet, I'm sorry. <laughs> but it's par four, throwing my Hades. I'm looking to just get it as straight and as far as possible before I have to pitch up for the birdie. Okay, that's not too bad. I definitely, I released it early over here, but I'm glad it flipped a little bit and went straight in the middle. I'll still have a long upshot though. Um, the basket's right there. I'm gonna upshot with my Predator because I don't know if I can get my zone just that far. So I'm not gonna give this one too much. Come back, baby. Oh yeah, that's what we like to see. Let's go. That's hype. For birdie. Oh, I almost missed that. All right, that's three down. Still gotta get to six though. All right, hole 15, going my Mantis here. I'm gonna backhand. This is really icy, so I'm probably not gonna give this too much power. Uh, backhand straight up, have it float over to the right a little bit so I can just go straight down for my upshot. Par four, by the way. How is this? Oh, yeah, this is gonna be interesting. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know how that just worked out. What the heck? <laughs> Ooh. Disc golf. Wow, right into the ground. That's terrible. <laughs> All right, hole 16, just a little over 400 feet. I got my Hades here, it's a par four again. Going all the way straight down. There's OB on this left side of the street here. Ooh, that's a headwind. I am not throwing this Hades. Actually gonna do the force. I did hit a tree on that left side, but I think I stayed in bounds. I actually almost went out of bounds. Out of bounds is literally right here. But I skipped across. Now I just gotta throw my Predator on a little bit of an ante so I can come back, flex towards the basket, get my birdie. So I'm still three down, but after this, I've only got two holes left. So I gotta birdie all these. I can't with this tree right here. Ugh. That was so awkward. That was just an awkward throw. I'm gonna have a long putt for the birdie. I'm actually way closer than I thought, only like 15 feet. Don't know how, that was the most awkward shot I've ever thrown in my entire life. But there is a little wind. There's a deer way over there. I'm gonna have to go say hi to that after I make this. Can't feel my hand, it's so cold. Get in there, let's go. Whew, cold hands don't even make a difference. No, it's running away. Oh, you just saw the tail, dang it. Okay, hole 17, 
throw in my Hades once again. Throw it all the time. Anyway, I'm not sure how far this one is. I think it's like 600 something feet. I think 640. But you just gotta go around the bend here and then it's all the way uphill. So it's a little harder than it looks. I hope not. I really thought I went into this snow pile here. Let's find out. I don't know who rolled this thing up. Oh, okay. I'm just on the other side. That would have been so unfortunate just to be in the middle of that. All right. All the way up the hill there. Can't even see it yet. It's over the hill. Oh, that, that was bad. Yeah, it didn't even go anywhere. I'm gonna have a upshot. There's the deer again. Let's look at them. Look at all them. So cute. It's too cold. Oh my gosh. Go to sleep. You're gonna die out here. Wind is really picking up. Anyway, I'm throwing my zone. There's a down branch right there from these pine trees, but I just gotta go right over it, and that's where the basket is. Sadly, not gonna get a birdie unless I throw this in. Well, I didn't throw it in, but that is parked. All these branches is what I'm talking about. Oh, no way. I didn't even know there was this other one over here. Jeez. I'm probably right in the middle of it. Yep. Eh. Still easy five footer. All right, last hole out here, hole 18 for the McNaughton Longs. It is 849 feet, par four, all the way down there. To me, hardest hole in the course besides hole 11, but I'm throwing my Zeus. I am at four under, sadly, unless I get a miracle shot. I am not gonna get to six under, but it was still a pretty good round. Let's end it. It is so muddy, so windy, and so cold. I can't express how grateful I am that cars have heat. I am so excited to get done with this course. It is one of my favorite courses, but I am so cold. Can't feel my face. Can't feel my hand. Oh, see, couldn't even hold on to the camera. Can't feel my hands. <laughs> I, I gotta finish strong. Man. Let's do it for the people. I gotta use a mini marker because I want to use this disc again. It's too windy to throw anything else, honestly. Oh yeah, wind, just take that one, that's fine. All right, that's gonna be a pretty long upshot to get to you get the par. Oh God, what am I doing to myself? Going with my zone for the last upshot of the day. Trying to throw it in here, you know, it's probably gonna happen, you know. But I still got maybe 100 to 125 feet left. Let's do it. Oh, it's on a streamline. Oh, the snow just ate it up. I didn't think I was gonna have to try and save par, but now I gotta make this 25, 30 footer. This back nine was brought to you by Bad Disc Golf. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Actually, it wasn't too bad. Uh, I shot one under on the back nine.
that is not too great, but I ended the whole thing with three under. Again, if you haven't watched the front nine, go check it out. It's gonna be up there for you one more time. I'm just gonna tap this out real quick. All right, so subscribe, like, and also comment. Share with everybody, people. We gotta get everybody watching this channel. We're gonna keep going up. Tune in next time. Oh my gosh, heat. <laughs>